Hello, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy once again. Today's task is we are going to get all of the Dedalian keys, finish that side quest, hopefully totally. It's going to require me running around the castle, I think, a bit. I don't know if I really can look up where those are, just because I don't... I have zero idea what is left, so compared to like what I found already, so uh, we're going to have to do it the hard way. Unless, maybe, I just thought about this. Okay, no. I do not have any in my inventory. Oh, great. Right. Well, that's fine. Uh, yes, we're gonna finish that. We're gonna hope we run into more side quests. I, uh, realize I have been playing this entire game without, um, collecting some rewards. So I did that before this. So we're gonna go through, I'm gonna do a whole revamp of our outfit, see if we can figure out something with that. So if next scene I look different, that's why. Otherwise, we are gonna try and get as much done as we can today before moving on to the main quests. While I was looking through all my rewards, I noticed, and I'll just show you guys actually. Uh, let's see, it was in challenges. And then the quests. So this one, complete main quests, it says I have 11 out of 14. So I'm assuming we are uh, very, very close to the end. I don't know if once you finish it, the game is just over, or if it still lets you do stuff after. That's why I'm trying to finish the side quest now, just in case. But the complete side quest stuff, I'm at 14 out of 32, guys. Now, I, we are on the last one, so I think 32 is the last one. However, we have a lot to catch up on, so I'm I'm hoping that I could find all of them, but if not, I guess we'll figure it out. I've also noticed the combat stuff, it's just a matter of killing stuff, right? Quest we just looked at, exploration. There is a lot of dang stuff that I have not done, which I knew that just based off of looking at like, you know, the map and whatnot. But I think what we really need to do is literally go through this entire world map and figure out, like, look, there's a side quest. Haven't done that yet. Oh, I... A voice coming from it. I want to do that one. Sorry, guys, but that's intriguing. But I need to go through and do all the Merlin trials. This one, I think, yeah, field guide pages, a bunch of those. I'm assuming while we go through, the, or, like, stuff like this, too. Like, the astronomy tables or the ancient magic hotspot. All of that was included in that. I also want to run and find all of the flu flames. So basically, I don't know if I will leave a lot of this in the videos. You guys can let me know if you want me to start doing that. Otherwise, I'm going to just keep cutting them out like I have been and just kind of getting as much done as I can. So hopefully you guys don't mind. But where we're going to start first is just running around Hogwarts and trying to find the last three uh, Dedalian keys. I think it said we only had three left. Oh, that was the wrong one. Okay. Oh, look. Haha. <laughs> Just a level four. Oh my god, I could have done that ages ago. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, I have three more keys left. I feel like that's doable. Oh. Wait. Oh. So I just gotta wait. I wonder if I need to con con blah, 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 continue finding those and then he'll get back to me. We'll see. Anyways, like I said, we're just going to run around Hogwarts, okay? If anything happens, I will let you know. Oh, guys, I found a note. I don't know how to say that name. I received your letter this morning and am thrilled to hear that all is going well for you and Natsai at Hogwarts, even if Natsai has been a little challenging of late. I suppose it is only to be expected since both of our daughters are, how should I put it, strong-willed. We miss you at Wagadu. I remember how to say that one. It is not the same without you, but we understand why you felt the need to move on. I do not think that I could have remained here myself under the circumstances. How life does send us all down such unpredictable paths. One tr never truly knows what awaits, not even those such as yourself who have the sight. But I am confident that good things are ahead for you and Natsai, at Hogwarts or wherever you may go. I do hope to hear from you again, and I wish you the best of luck in the meantime. Your loyal friend, Amali. Aww. I found another note. Talk to Pippin about the below, how fitting it would be if the key to my cure lay in the obscure Grinian hair... Angelica, Wormwood Essence, Plangitine, Spleenwort. Whose room is this? Why do they need to know about that? Oh. 
Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry Hospital Wing, attending healer Nurse Noreen Bailey, patient name redacted by order of Professor Black, age redacted by order of Professor Black, notes. The patient was injured during a Quidditch match, though in my professional opinion, a redacted by order of Professor Black hardly counts as an injury. In fact, if anyone was injured, it was me, as I do not believe I've ever rolled my eyes quite so hard in my life. It is a wonder I can even see to write this note. Rather unbelievably, or indeed despicably, the headmaster now wants to cancel Quidditch all because a pure blood went in before the snitch was even in sight. When I pressed the headmaster slightly, I was told staggering. Ah, so what I'm hearing is it really shouldn't have been canceled. Hogwarts School, which is going to be a hospital ring, a tenor healer, nursery, really. Patient. Oh! Oh, I thought this was the same. Tasmina McLagan, or so we assume, age 13, notes. The patient stumbled in without a head. After a head count of the dorms and absolutely no assistance from the headmaster, we concluded that the student was most likely Tasmina McLadden. Despite the obvious communication challenges, I was able to discern that the poor girl was suffering from vanishing sickness. I recommend that she be sent to St. Mungo's at once, partly owing to the time-sensitive nature of the diagnosis and partly because nearly headless Nick was floating around moaning on and on about how very lucky she was. He was most distracting and if he disrupts my dealings with the future headless students, I shall have no choice but to ask the headmaster to interview. Addendum, I'm told that the patient is recovering and can be expected to return to the castle soon. Of no particular significance, Nick now seems to be avoiding me. One might assess that he's steeping himself in somewhat childish sulk. I am finding the most random stuff while searching this castle. <laughs> Guys, I'm pretty sure I did it. I am pretty sure this is the last Nalian key. Like, I have to keep you guys with me for this moment. Excellent. Okay, is this the last one? <gasps> guys, I did it! Oh my gosh. So is all that's left for this is just to put him in the thing, I think? It is! Oh my gosh, okay. We did one thing at least. Yay! I'm gonna finish exploring this area because I have never been here before, fun fact. And then I am going to go... Well, we're gonna go and put the house quest... The house crests in. And then we are going to go... I suspect you are the one who has been interfering with a rather personal matter. <gasps> the Demigai statues and the moons contained therein were placed as they were for good reason. You should not meddle in the personal affairs of others. Wait, I'm so intrigued. I don't think Mr. Pemberton meant to use his own stationery. He knows something about those Demigai's moons. He's in oh. Hogsmeade, apparently. Perhaps I shall pay him a visit. Wait, that's so funny. Okay, well, we're doing that too. But then we're also going to investigate the well. That's where I was getting at. Okay, y'all, it's time. Are we going to actually get anything for this? This Tadalian Keys Challenge is coming along nicely. Last one. Here we go. The last house token. Time to see what's inside. Oh. What is it? What did I get? Y'all, what did I get? Well, look at that. <gasps> Thanks goes to the former headmistress, Eupraxia Mole. <laughs> oh, was that a super cool thing? Is it actually- oh my god, imagine it's not even better. Okay, y'all. I put my little snazzy cloak on. Look at us. You really can't see it that well, but big fan. Okay, now, who am I needing to speak to? Who- what is- what is- hey? Oh, I need to go speak with Nelly. Y'all, it has been so long since I started this dang side quest. I totally forgot we had to talk to someone in the beginning. I just felt like it just spawned. Anyways, oh my gosh. I actually really enjoyed this cloak. Hey, Nelly. Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? I was. Girl. Please. Hello, Nelly. Actually, I've found I look so all snazzy. the keys and opened my house chest. Oh, wonderful. What did you find? I found a rather interesting costume. Brilliant. Oh, uh, that I'm wearing. <laughs> well, thank you for solving that mystery for me. I always wondered what those keys would lead to. You're welcome. Okay, well, I think the one guy with the moons is also going to be in Hogwarts. Yes. Okay, well, let's talk to him since we're right here anyways. 
And then we're gonna go check out that well. Oh, okay. We also have a summoner's court thing. So let's just, let's just go ahead and get this done. Hey. Hello, are you here for summoner's court? That I am. Don't expect to be as lucky here as you were in crossed ones. Oh my goodness. Speaking of which, care to lose, I mean, play a match? Somebody tells me you're not gonna uh, win. So, of course, she made the best summoner win. She's sassy. Perfect. Exactly as planned. Oh my gosh, should I do it? Nice technique. I do it. You are good. Ha <laughs> ha! Did it. <laughs> I'm not too proud to admit when I've lost. Where did you learn to play like that? Mm. I practice as much as I can. It's practice, a eh? Big lie, but it's I right. suppose I could try that. Well, you've only one opponent left now. Oh. I won't say more than that, but let's just say he's the best for a reason. There's still another one? What? Well, that explains why there's so many side quests. Okay, now we will go talk to Mr. Man with the moons. Okay. Took time and effort. Oh, Lord. Pardon me, sir, but about those curious demigod statues I've seen. What? Who are you? Why do you ask? Um. What do I say? I feel like I gotta call him out. They're causing Mr. Moon terrible distress. Ha! Good. That was the idea. Oh. So you did create them. I... Uh, yes, I did. <laughs> it was a ploy to give that pathetic oaf Moon a taste of the grief he caused me years ago. You are the one who's been pilfering them. I am, at the request of Mr. Moon. I received your owl on your stationery. <clears throat> ah. Oh my goodness. Well... Fitting Moon would enlist a student too cowardly to do it himself <laughs> hasn't changed a bit. Even when we were at school, he was a cowardly bully. Gave me a horrible nickname, which I shan't repeat. I want to know. I was thrilled when we left school and he seemed gone for good. Then I started seeing him around Hogsmeade. It was too much. Even if I do take satisfaction in that his life's destiny was to be a lowly caretaker. Oh boy. Mr. Moon does a good deal for the school, and he's taught me a lot. He's terrified of those statues. <laughs> I know. You should have seen his face when that boggart appeared. Oh, priceless. That's when I knew what I needed to do. I simply didn't want to encounter him anymore. So, I shrewdly put a boggart in his path to learn his greatest fear. I then created the demiguy statues to keep him in his place, so to speak. The moons were inspired play on his name. It worked brilliantly. Until you started clearing them out. Yeah. Oh, yep. I feel like this is the one moment I'm gonna be sassy. The statues are a form of bullying. You'll know better than him. Perhaps it's time you both moved on. Ah, fair point, I suppose. If they've terrified him, as you say, he may have learned his lesson. 
Wow. Oh, I have to go back and talk to him now? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's talk to him. I kind of hope this is over with. Mr. Moon, I've learned who's behind the demigod statues. Oh no. Should I? I'm just gonna say friend. It was an old schoolmate of yours, Piers Pemberton. Oh, am I a known? Pigtails Piers. Oh. <laughs> I don't think he likes being called that. Of course he does. Oh, we had such flowing locks. Oh, we used to laugh about them. <laughs> I laughed the hardest of all. Clever, mm. clever man. <laughs> hmm. I'd no idea he was so devious. <laughs> I must go and congratulate him. Whatever statues remain seem less terrifying now that I know they were put out by old pigtails. Oh boy. Continue collecting them if you like. As for me, I'm gonna go and pay a visit to my old friend. Is he your friend though? Okay, well, in that case, we're finally gonna go do this well quest. Why am I kind of nervous for what we're gonna find in this well? Like, is- I'm assuming it's a person? But like, what is this gonna lead to? Okay, hello? <coughs> hello? What on hello? earth? There's a voice coming from that well. What? <coughs> Can you help me? Is someone down there? Down there? Oh, beg your pardon? I'm here! <coughs> There's no one here but me! What the heck? Um, some a bit of into me and <coughs> he caught. If you could please take it. <coughs> Why does this feel like a trap? Oh, what is this? Huh? Seems to be some sort of map. Well, at least better than it take me. Okay. Where the heck is this? Of course, it doesn't say. That is upsetting. I don't know where that goes. Well, that honestly wasn't as exciting as I had hoped. <laughs> there is another side quest all the way down here. And there's a flu flame down there. Let's do it. Oh. Oh, hold on. I just ran it. Oh, wait. I think I need to talk to Eddie for the side quest. Sorry, I, I was burgling into people's houses. My dearest Eddie, I was so pleased to receive your letter. It has been too long since I've been home. You may be interested to know that my time with the ministry will soon be coming to an end. It seems they forced me into an early retirement, and there's not much I can do to change their minds. No matter. In all my years as an Auror, I've seen over and over again how those at the top are more interested in preserving their place than in actually serving those about them. But that's enough of that. There, <laughs> Oh my goodness. There will be time enough to tell you the tales of my life out here in the great big world when we meet again. You'll be happy to know that I'm coming home soon, although I am thinking of settling in Upper Hogsfield upon my return, still nearby. I intend to enjoy the time I have left. There are still mysteries to solve after all. Ever your sister, Helen Thistlewood, London. Oh. Okay. We actually have more Hello. side quests over here than I thought. Oh my god, hold on. There's another note to Eddie. Eddie, the Goblin Rebellion's attacks on Feldkopf are becoming more frequent. They seem to be searching for something. At least I failed to I failed to find another reason why they would target our little hamlet. Regardless, trade is suffering and the people are struggling. Feldkopf could certainly benefit from your creativity and optimism right now. You always seem to have the cleverest ideas. Any suggestions, my friend? I'm not sure how much longer Feldkopf can survive. Yours, Bernard. Hey, Eddie. You sound as if you could use some help. Oh yes, I could. Eddie Thistlewood's the name. A dear friend of mine in Feldcroft is at his wit's end due to the relentless attacks on his hamlet by Ranrock and his loyalists. I sent two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages to help, but they've gone missing. Uh-oh. Good idea. Those cabbages are nothing to be trifled with. My thoughts precisely. You see, 
I know plants, and I believe the goblins will be so irritated by the onslaught of ferocious vegetation, they'll simply leave Feldcroft alone. I wonder if you might track the two crates down and deliver their contents to my friend Bernard Indiai. I simply can't leave my shop at present. Okay. Why would the goblins target Feldcroft? My friend Bernard says they've been seen in the area for a while. He seems to think they're looking for something, but lately they've become more aggressive. Okay. Could you not grow or buy more Chinese trumping cabbages? I suppose I could, but that would take time. Time we do not have, what with Ranrock's thugs posing new threats every day. Besides, it's the principle of the matter. I grew those cabbages and they are extraordinary. Hey, fair enough. I I am not judging. Any idea where I might find the crates? Yes. From what I hear, one was spotted south of Feldcroft, the other, so I hear, is south of Brockborough near the river. Okay. Very well, sir. I shall keep an eye out for two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. Oh, thank you. I shall let Bernard know he might be receiving those cabbages after all. I should be going now. Thank you. Okay, I know... I'm convinced that Feldcroft will be much safer with Chinese chomping cabbages defending them. Hey, maybe. You never know. Welcome. Sounds like Feldcroft's in trouble. Perhaps I should try to help. There is indeed... Oh, a secret. One, a flu flame, and two, another side quest we can start if we're here. So, might as well. What needs doing, needs doing. Hey. Is everything all right? If the Hamlet sent you here to talk to me about, about. Huh? I know what I have to do. Well, I'm confused. Not every day a girl has to put down her own throat. <gasps> I should be allowed to work up to it. What? What do you mean, your own troll? I thought that's why you were here. I'm sorry. Uh, I suppose if you spend enough time with trolls, you forget your manners. I'm Alexandra. I didn't mean to be short with you. With Ranrock's lot seemingly everywhere, I thought the Hamlet could use a bit more security. <sighs> but my plan has gone awry. What's happened? I apologized when he almost trampled half the Hamlet yesterday. He just needs more time. She talking wants him gone. They think it's mad my training a troll. Impossible even. We're talking like a giant troll. It certainly takes a lot of courage to try. I'll give you that. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. I wish others felt the same. But I suppose I understand why everyone's been so concerned. What made me think I could train him? I should have learned from Barnabas the Barmy. But he's my troll and my problem. I'll be honest. I'm afraid I won't be able to take care of him. He's stronger than any troll I've ever encountered. I wish I knew someone else who could do it. Um, am I supposed to kill him? Because I'm gonna feel bad. What exactly were you training the troll to do? I was hoping to train him to serve as protection for us. Frankly, I struggled to teach him even a word or two. Couldn't give him even a semblance of self-control. Okay. Who's Barnabas the Barmy? Surely you've seen the tapestry of him at Hogwarts. It hangs in the seventh floor corridor. He allegedly tried to train trolls for the ballet. <coughs> you can imagine how that turned out. I'm not thrilled at the prospect, but I'll consider it. Oh, no. I didn't mean to suggest that you should do it. In fact, you should avoid the area just southwest of here. At least until I work up the courage to do what needs to be done. Ah, girl, you're good. I got this. Okay, well, I didn't really want to have to fight a troll today, but I guess I can. Troll on the loose near a hamlet. That could be devastating. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, let's try and as quickly as possible go and take out this troll. And then we're also going to try and go find the cabbages, and then I think we're going to call it good at that. I Imagine... You're Alexandra's friend. Oh. Girlfriend, what made you think that you could train a troll? Ah. Oh. I feel awful for Alexandra. But the helmet needed to 
be saved from that troll. You're telling me I forgot that I had the Avada Kedavra and I literally just sat there and tried to fight that for like 10 minutes? That's upsetting. Well, all we gotta find now is the cabbages. I thought they were gonna talk about this one. I was like, that's not a troll. It's done, Alexandra. I took care of him. My troll? What? Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. I wish things could have turned out differently for him. Yeah. There wasn't much he could have done. He was beyond training. He tried to kill me the entire time. Goodness. I'm glad you're all right. You're very brave. People in the hamlet had already crafted a moniker for whoever eventually defeated my... I mean, that troll. It was troll something or other. Oh? Vanquisher. Vanquisher? Yes, that was it. I suppose it's your title now. I need some time on my own. But truly, thank you for what you did. You're welcome. The troll vanquisher. Suppose I did earn the title. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go try and find these cabbages. Oh my gosh, this is a camp. Ugh, I did not think I'd have to fight things. Chomping cabbages is somewhere in this camp. This is annoying. Personally, I'm gonna try and sneak this because I don't want to deal with an actual fight. <laughs> Who just saw me? I see you. No, you don't. Oh, well, he's not dead. Oh man, where are you? Oh, I did it. Okay, now where are these cabbages? That's one crazy oh. hand. I only need one more. I swear if I have to fight for this one too, I'm gonna be a little bit upset. Oh my god, I definitely do. <sighs> It'd be fine if my game would decide to load. You can see why Feldcroft Ranrock's loyalists are hiding out near Feldcroft. They must have the other crate of Chinese chomping cabbages. I literally see it. It's right there. How long for a bacon and mushroom stew? Uh, pity. Oh, guys, I have notes. Ranrock suspects there is more of it in Feldcroft. Do not return until you found it. What? Dem Ranrock demands an update. Have you found it? Report back immediately. Found what? What is in Feldcroft? Have I missed something? That's all of the crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood's friend in Feldcroft. Okay, I'm on the way. I feel like so much has happened in this game that I cannot keep the story straight. Like, this, are they talking about Anne? I don't feel like they are. But I guess I don't know for sure. What else could be in Feldcroft? Hello there. Do you have the special delivery for my dear friend, Eddie? I do. Hello, Mr. Ndai. Eddie Thistlewood sent me. Yes, he told me to expect you. How? Do you have the Chinese chomping cabbages? How did he tell you that fast? I have them right here. Marvelous. This will go a long way towards protecting the hamlet from Ranrock's loyalists. The same foul curs who, I'm willing to guess, intercepted them in the first place. Along with Rookwood's lot, Feldcroft owes a debt of gratitude to you and Eddie. Thank you for your help. You are welcome. Oh, he's gonna tell me. Do you have any idea why the goblins are attacking Maybe. Feldcroft? No clue. Ugh. I used to think it was because of its strategic location, but now it's as if they were looking for something. I will admit, however, that I don't know what they could possibly be looking for. Interesting. How do you and Eddie know each other? We met at Hogwarts. Been friends and business associates ever since. 
I wasn't surprised to get his owl about his Chinese chomping cabbage scheme. He was always one to go out of his way to help another. That's nice. You're welcome. Happy to be of assistance. Okay, cool. At last, some reinforcements. Hopefully this is enough to thwart the goblins. I don't know if it will be, but, you know. Okay, well, we didn't necessarily do a whole lot uh, storyline-wise, but we finished the Dedalian Keys quest, we finished the Moon quest. There is some extra moons we can find. I don't know if it matters if we find all of them. I feel like it's probably just like an achievement type thing. Um, and then we completed at least two extra side quests on top of- Oh no, we technically did three because we did the Summoner's Corp. Um, I don't know if I included that or not, but we did do it. So, yeah, we're slowly getting there. It's, yeah, it's really just gonna be tedious things, I think. Um, if you guys don't think it's worth it to be doing all the side quests, please let me know, then I won't worry about it. But, yeah, I feel like I have a lot left. Like, I just can- we're at 19 out of 32, it said. So, we still have, what- 13 then that was math i don't know if that was correct math but that was math so yeah you guys can let me know maybe i'll do some research maybe not i don't know we'll see <laughs> but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed um yeah we're just gonna leave it there so i will see you all next week for more hogwarts legacy bye